So just a quick little update, completion of a project. This is the uh, latest in the uh, gauntlet category. So finally got her done. You can see the thumb, how the fingertips are protected. How it fits on top of the, or fits the sword that I tend to use. So this is, this is the latest. And not quite the first, but <clears throat> this was the er earliest model that I've got of the, the same gauntlet. This one was originally made about 30 years ago. I've rebuilt it a couple of times. But all the, uh, the initial leather parts, <coughs> the thumb, fingertip protector and that, I mean, they're all pretty much the same thing. Uh, the only difference is that in the early days, I never bothered to cover the seams like I have here. So uh, they were just raw. It would look more like this. So, but... <coughs> This one is, again, most of the hardening comes from the water forming that I do. Uh, the wax that I use on it, the beeswax, um, microcrystalline, is basically more to protect it from getting penetrated by water or sweat. So, but uh, it staples really well. It gives a lot of protection. Now, people wonder what I do on the inside, and I don't think you can really see it here, unfortunately, with the lighting being the way it is. Um, I tend to use a uh, form of dryer, of uh, boot felt. Actually, you can see a little more of it in here. I tend to use boot felt, uh, about half an inch, three quarters of an inch of padding to protect the protect my fingers from when I do manage to catch a shot. Um, with the hand rather than guarding with the fort of the sword so but anyway that's it it's all done and uh, as you can see it staples rather well let's see if i can get it from the other end here yeah you can see the reinforce that i do now to protect the leather from the wear and tear that uh, happens with the use of the sword you can see I didn't do that in the early ones. So you can see that around here it's just it's just pretty raw. So and this is usually where it wears out is in here and down in here it gets torn up pretty bad over time. So anyway. That's them. Till next time.